was that? Um, I got rid of the most effective diet, you know, um, pill ever, which was ephedrine, you know, they got rid of that. So it, it behooves America to stay fat, sick and dying. Would you say that that, that ephedrine is better than uh, clenbuterol or T3 or what's the best fat burner out that there is? You never use thyroid um, at all, ever, unless you have a medical condition that requires it. Um, the the clenbuterol is something that you can't take all the time because it saturates. You have to break it up. You have to cycle on it and off it constantly in order to use it. So either two weeks on, two weeks off, or two days on, two days off, um, something like that. Why, why is that? Why are you against it? Because your body, if, if to take it in a, in a, in a, in a dose that's going to be effective, is going to is going to suppress your body's pro own production of it, and unlike your 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 testicles the your the your um thyroid production does not come back once really? it's been down regulated yes so you'll end up either having to take thyroid for the rest of your life or you're going to be really fat and there's a ton of bodybuilders from the 80s who fried their thyroid dieting for shows using cytomel and they are paying for it now Really? So you'll so then you're just metabolism shot after that? Yeah, you get you you either have to keep taking it or you're just going to get really fat. Yep. Wow.